I'll never forget it. I walked into a kollel, and people were really into their learning. It was beautiful. But then I noticed this sign on the wall that made me wonder. It said, the members of the kollel do not interrupt their studies for even the most pressing matters. Please do not disturb. I was thinking, really? Is that correct? Good morning. The Talmud says that Rabbi Yishuman Bar Yochai was distinct among the sages of his time in that Torah to umanuto. His Torah was his craft, it was his profession. There was nothing else he did but study Torah. The Talmud says that the sages of his time tried to copy him. They tried also to not work at all and just study Torah, but they were unable to. Only some unique students of Rabbi Shimon were able to be on that level. And the Rebbe says that in our time, although we cannot be on the level of Rabbi Shimon all the time, but part of the day we have to totally focus on our Torah study, as if we had no other profession. And yet, there's a reason, the Rebbe said, why no one can reach the level of Rabbi Shimon. And the reason is because God doesn't want us to. There are so many thousands of Jewish men and women and little children who have never heard of the letter Aleph. And they're waiting for someone like you and I to invite them to learn a little bit more about their own heritage. So none of us have the luxury of saying, I'm like Rabbi Shimon and I don't disturb my studies for the most pressing matters. We all need to spend time studying Torah, true. But... In addition to studying Torah, we have an obligation, a holy obligation, to spend part of our day reaching out to others as well. We dedicate our minute of Torah today to Nava Morvich in honor of her birthday today and to a brand new baby girl soldier in the army of Hashem who was just born yesterday. Mazel Tov to Aaron and Yael Rivka. May your daughter grow to Torah, Chupa, Masim Tovim. Also, I'd like to dedicate this to the neshama of Rabbi Moshe ben Yechiel, whose anniversary of passing is today. May his neshama have an aliyah. And in honor of the birthday of Rabbi Moshe Faithful, his birthday is tonight for a year of bracha v'atzlacha. Have a wonderful day.